how to add PayPal to your Wix website. Hi guys, welcome back to another video and in this video I'm going to be telling you how you can add PayPal in your Wix website. So having said that, let's just jump into the video. Now I'm over here on Wix and what I'm going to do is I'm just simply going to go ahead and sign up. So to sign up, simply click on get started over here and I am also going to be using a temporary email address to sign up. So I'm just simply going to copy the email and I'm going to come back over here onto Wix and I'm going to go ahead and sign up. So I'm just simply going to click on the sign up button over here and I'm going to enter in my email address and then I'm going to enter in my password and then I'm just simply going to click on the sign up button. And once you've done that, let's just go ahead and click on get started. So you're going to answer a bunch of different questions, but you can go ahead and skip these questions as well. So I'm going to go ahead and skip all of these questions and because I just know that what I'm about to do, it doesn't really matter. Then over here, enter in the name of your website. So I'm just simply going to copy the first name of my email, paste it over here and click on next. And then what are your goals for this website? You can answer these questions if you want, but I'm going to skip these for now because we don't generally need to why they're asking these questions is because they want to you know funnel you the website that you're looking for like you know they're going to give you a bunch of different templates but once you've answered these questions they're going to narrow down which type of templates you're going to be you're going to like depending upon your answers so then what do you want to add to your website pricing plans or tables or whatever so let's go ahead and add a pricing plan because you know we are going to be adding paypal but if you don't want to you can go ahead and uncheck this and leave it at that and then just simply click on next or skip these entirely so we're just simply going to skip these because if we're going to be using a template they're going to have all of these questions anyway so have you created a website before i've created a few yeah why not so i'm going to click on that option now you have two options you can go ahead and get started with the wix adi to create a website for you now adi stands for wix is artificial intelligence which is going to ask you a bunch of questions like simple questions what is your goal and stuff like that and then depending upon your answer it's going to generate a website for you and you can go with that or you can continue with the editor and you can choose a template so i'm going to go ahead and choose the second option over here and get started with the template and then over here as you can see these are all the templates that we have so over here all these templates we can choose which one we want it all depends on you this is one of the great things about wix is that you know they have really amazing templates and pretty amazing and none of these websites look similar to each other as well so we can go ahead and continue with each one of them or you know continue and make our own so let's go ahead and find a website that we want so over here we have some you know category so let's go ahead and go with a store so let's go ahead and fashion and clothing yeah i think that looks good so yeah i think this looks this website looks good let's go ahead and view it and see how that looks all right so yeah so this is the template looks pretty decent looks pretty cool yeah i think this would look nice as a website we can add like our own products and images so yeah let's go ahead and edit this website we're gonna edit it out click on the button the editor is loading up so catch you guys in a second all right so the editor has loaded up and this is how it looks like right so you can go ahead and edit this website out however you feel like it it all depends on you you know you can go ahead and edit this out but that's not why we're here today we're here to you know add a payment system within our website so to do that what you can do is come over here onto the left side you know you have your applications over here media tools and all of that you just simply click on this plus icon to add an element or you click on the find apps over here when you click on over here it's going to take you over to the wix app market over here but first things first we need to go ahead and publish the website to actually get started so we'll just publish it out so that's done we can go ahead and view this website but yeah that's done now let's go back to this website's dashboard so we'll click on the settings over here and go back to the dashboard as well all right so over here what we're going to do is we're going to add a payment method right so come over here onto the left side you're going to see a bunch of different options so over here we have subscriptions store products all of that we have marketing and seo finance and everything right so what we're going to do is actually and over here what we're going to do is come over here underneath settings and we're going to go into settings and we're going to go ahead and find that options right so so scroll down below you will see accept payments right so you can add that over there 
you will also have a bunch of different other ones but yeah generally this is where you add your payment methods right e-commerce and finance you have product settings order settings checkout settings tax and all of that so you click on accept payments and then you will have your option to manual payments option right but this is now what we're looking for we could add that but we want to add paypal so for that we can also go into the app store again go into app market and in our app market these are all recommended for you but uh what you're going to do is just simply search for it over here or get more apps as well go into app ma app market i don't think i went there the first time but let's go there now so over here what you're going to do is just simply search for paypal so search for paypal right here as you can see and you will have a bunch of different options so you will have paypal button uh, wix paypal paypal button over here so you can go ahead and add that this is basically you know a button that you can add onto your website so you can add this to your website right you can add it to your site and then that's it now there's another thing that you can do is when you go into your you know website editing tool right like over here this is the editor go back over here again you can click over here onto the plus icon the add element button you can add that button directly from over here as well so you will have buttons you over here you click on the button section and you will see you have paypal button or pay button right just click on paypal button it's going to open up all of your paypal buttons right over here you can go ahead and add this to your website and then once you added that you can go ahead and connect your paypal account to receive payments so for example if i wanted to add this button all i'd have to do is just simply click over this button it's going to open up over here it's going to add it over here that's pretty small so actually let me just make it a little bit bigger like you know actually let me remove that and add that to another section let me just add that section over here and in that section i want to add the button where is it for that we need to add a store button as well i'll we'll click on store button all right so i think we've added a blank section over here now what we'll do is we'll click on the plus icon again we can add elements we'll add the paypal button over here so all we got to do is just simply click over here there we go it is a little bit small i don't know why but generally this is how it looks like then we just simply click on the setting options over here selling we click on the add paypal info over there we can go ahead and add some you know paypal info over there this is the button size this is like the animation of as well we can add different animations to it but generally you just simply have to click on add paypal info over here what is your paypal email you simply add over here what is the product name what is your id and you know what is the current over here what is the current price all of that and then once you have set everything up you're good to go pretty much that's it that's how you do it that's how you add a paypal button to a website store now as i said you can go into the settings and add that info over there as well so it's pretty much all up to you so let me actually go over here you can add that paypal button directly from the app store as well you can go into the settings and go into billing addresses over there you can add that as well a bunch of different options that you can use to add your own payment method to add your you know paypal account so pretty much that's it that's how you do it and uh, yeah and you will also have this option right here when you create your first uh, website set up payment method so you just simply click on set up payment method and it's going to directly take you over to the settings and within the settings it's going to take you of course to that place where i told you about the manual payments over here and to start accepting manual payments and you know start accepting online payments you'd have to upgrade your plan to a business plan or whatever so that you can actually go ahead and do that so let me actually log into my other account which is a premium account and show you how you can do that as well so over here as you can see we have some different options as well so you can also change your location to get more options as well so over here as you can see accept credit and debit with wix so and we have paypal option over here just simply click on the connect button and then just enter in the details follow these steps and you are good to go so simply enter in your paypal email click on connect and you'll be redirected to paypal and then just simply sign into that and you're good to go easy peasy right so yeah that's it that is it for this video guys hope you guys enjoyed this video if you have any questions let me know in the comment sections down below and i'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible so having said that we'll catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye